Uh, you have the ability to program it here uh, at the terminal as well as use the camera for automated probing. Uh, I'm thinking most people, if they know our next control, they know the Neo, they probably know about our uh, pretty awesome 3D probing setup on this. Uh, quite a bit different than if you're used to using, say, a Renishaw probe and a Haas. Um, with this, we use the camera. So basically, we see what our z-axis sees. So when I want to probe something, I drag the machine where I want it to probe, and the machine will move around following my touch. So in that way, it's extremely easy to use, but it gets even easier when it comes time to probe something. So here, for example, is a piece of material set up on our pneumatic vices. And if I want to probe the center of this, I don't need to input any numbers. I'm just drawing the feature that I want to probe, and it will plot out the points for me. Then from there, I can adjust the dimensions of it by hand, change where it measures for Z offset, change where it measures an edge, both edges, I can drag it inside if I want to measure the inside of a feature. I can also measure two points along an edge to find the rotation of it. So this for a short run sort of work is what we're commonly recommending uh, users uh, use. You could do it through Fusion, but I actually think it's quite a bit easier just to do it at the control. Uh, a really neat feature is that when you post out of Fusion, it's posting all your workpiece dimensions and also your origin uh, location so that when you go to probe, it presents an image of where the origin is set on that part. Uh, so it makes it really easy for uh, a non-machinist to be able to walk up and figure out quickly, where do I probe this part? Okay, for instance, I can pull one up. If I have a program on here. So we'll do load program. So it's loading it in right now and it shows here, program origin of the workpiece is top center of my stock. And it pulled that in from the file that's in our editor. Gives you all the information here about cutting tools, about workpiece dimensions, the geometry, etc., etc. So probing is extremely easy on this machine, uh, easier than if you were to do it in Fusion, I would argue. Um, but I believe the functionality is coming. Um, I've, I've worked closely with some people at Autodesk, and there's actually some really cool functions that I believe are coming to Fusion uh, in the not too distant future. So I'll be talking uh, more with uh, them uh, and Datron about uh, collaborating to bring some of those cool functions to Next.